MS Outlook has stopped working. Is your Outlook not responding? Microsoft Outlook is without a doubt is one of the most adaptable email clients accessible now. But on the other hand, it is prone to several bugs and issues. Freezing or not responding is one of the most common errors encountered by an Outlook user. So, how to get rid of the Microsoft Outlook not responding error without losing any files? And how to make it back to work properly again? Don't worry in this video we are going to discuss all the possible and practical methods to fix this issue without losing PST email files. Before discussing the methods to resolve this error, first, let us discuss why this error occurs. The Outlook is missing major updates or you haven't installed the latest updates. MS Outlook is in use by some other program. Installing a new add-in that interferes with Outlook. Interference due to an antivirus program. Your mailbox has reached the maximum capacity. Damaged or corrupted Outlook data files. A conflict between Outlook and another program. Methods to resolve the Outlook not responding issue. Sometimes this error gets resolved by simply restarting the MS Outlook application, but what if the error still persists? Then you have to use some other tactics to resolve this error. Safe termination of Outlook. Sometimes when you try to close Outlook, it doesn't shut off in the first attempt, and you continuously try to quit the program several times which causes the hang. In this condition, run Create Task Manager, and select Outlook, and then click on End Task. Disable your antivirus program. Most of the time, it is the conflict between the antivirus programs, which causes Outlook to freeze or hang. In this condition, you should disable the antivirus program, and then check whether Outlook works without any interruptions. Opening Outlook in safe mode. Unnecessary add-ins may affect Outlook performance and slow it down. There is a high chance that the add-ins are causing the Outlook to run abnormally. In this condition, you should run the Outlook in safe mode. To run Outlook in safe mode follow these steps. Press the Win plus R button to open the Run dialog box. In the Run dialog box, enter Outlook.x, safe and then click OK. In the Choose Profile window, select the default Outlook option and select OK to open that profile. The Outlook will start in safe mode. Disable your Outlook add-ins. As we have discussed, the add-ins affect Outlook performance. So, in this condition, we will disable all the add-ins at the same time. It is recommended that you should disable the add-ins one by one. Because in this way you can pinpoint the add-in which affects Outlook performance. Follow these steps. Click File then Options and then Add-ins. Select Com Add-ins from the Manage drop-down menu. Click Go. In the Com Add-ins dialog box, remove the checkmark beside the add-in you want to deactivate. You can uncheck, check the add-ins one by one to find which add-in is causing the problem. Once you're done, click OK. Repair Outlook data files. If none of the methods works then there is chance damaged, maybe your PST file is damaged or corrupted. In this condition, you can use a tool known as scanpst.x to repair your PST files. However, the scans tool also has some drawbacks. The scanpst tool is suitable for repairing minor damage and the tool becomes ineffective in case of major damage. It is unable to recover permanently deleted email items. It cannot repair password protected PST files. Don't worry if the scan PST tool does not work, we have a robust solution for you. With the Sasin 4 Outlook PST Repair Tool, you can repair the highly damaged PST files in a few seconds. The tool quickly repairs the PST files without any data loss, it can repair both PST and OST files. In many ways, the Sasin 4 Outlook PST Repair Tool is far superior to scanpst.x. Thank you for watching the video, for more such updates subscribe the channel and follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn.